Hey, good day everyone. Passivato here. This is now the third game for today. January 17, 2024, NBA Game Day. This is an Eastern Conference battle between Miami Heat and Toronto Raptors, which will happen at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. That's going to be 8.30 a.m. here in Manila. And I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Passive Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Approaching this game, Miami Heat, they got a record of 24 wins and 16 losses. While for Toronto Raptors, they carry with them a record of 15 and 25. We all know that we actually provide free picks right here in our YouTube channel. But for those who would want to avail our preview picks or preview packages, you might want to reach us through Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, or even Messenger. Just check on the descriptions of our videos and you would see the details right there. The spread that is given is 1.5 that's given towards Miami Heat. The Toronto Raptors, they would have the home court advantage with them. In terms of momentum though, this is quite obvious. We gotta give it to Miami Heat, man. Approaching this game, Miami Heat, they are on a three-game winning streak. And not only that, for their last 10 games, they have, won, they have won six. Comparing it to Toronto, man, approaching this game, Toronto Raptors, they have lost four straight. So that's kind of a slump, right? Also, for the last 10 games, they have only won three times, so definitely all momentum is siding towards Miami. In terms of fatigue, well, both teams are coming off rest, so we can just skip that part. Let's go ahead and take a look at the um, health and availability, all right? All right, starting with Miami Heat. I see three players confirmed out for this game. We got Drew Smith, uh, Pat West Jr., and Kevin Love. Again, all three are confirmed out for Miami. Now for Toronto, um, hold up. So for Toronto Raptors, uh, Pirtle, Coloco, and Otto Porter Jr. are all confirmed out still. And um, Grady Dick and Garrett Trent are both listed as questionable. So this is also a whole lot. Like three players confirmed out, including their starting center, and then a couple of other players, including for me, their best scorer off the bench, that's Garrett Trent Jr., tagged as questionable. So obviously, um, in terms of health, I'm going to go inside with, my, with Miami. All right, so I'm not really sure as to why the spread is only at minus 1.5. Let, let me go ahead and double check that one real quick um, Miami where you at uh, well it's now showing at minus 2.5 earlier it was at minus 1.5 so now I'm getting the now I'm getting the increase now minus 2.5 okay let's take that one minus 2.5 for Miami heat I really still am not moved by that I mean Taking a look at all factors that we just talked about, um, it's actually all Miami, except from the fact that um, Toronto Raptors, they are in Canada, you know, they are at home. But again, aside from that, everything is pointing towards Miami. They are on a roll. They have won three straight. Not only that, they have their best player. They have Jimmy Butler back. Now for Toronto Raptors, I know they had a great start after that trade, but <laughs> here they are now on a four game losing slump. Uh, they are having some injuries. They still don't have Bertel back. And now there are also some rumors uh, lingering around about Siakam or even some of their other players. And I'm pretty sure that it's not going to help their morale in their, lo in their locker room. So all out, I'm going to go inside with Miami Heat and I'll go ahead and take out that spread of minus 2.5. Again, it's Miami, minus 2.5. Peace out. Pass I love. And God bless.